Hi everybody, welcome back to Puggo News Around the World here. And today we're going to be unboxing Nickelodeon's re-release of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. So we're going to be taking a look at Donatello and Mikey from Playmates Toys. So, let's get to it. So, before we get started with today's video... I would like to let you guys know where I got these from. I got them from Walmart. And they are $13 a piece. And I would highly recommend going to your local Walmart. Because I know that they're out there right now and you can get them. And I would highly recommend buying them because they are really well worth it. And I'm super happy that Nickelodeon re-released these because they are really amazing. And they give me these really old school Playmate, Playmates toys vibes. And before we get started with today's video, I would like to say that this is part one. And then after this video, there will be a part two. And then after that video, there will be a part three. Well, and I'd highly recommend that you guys go to your local Walmart and pick these up because they are super well worth it. And shout out to Nickelodeon for remaking these and doing an awesome job at it. So, let's take a closer look up at Donatello. So, as you guys can see right here, here is Donatello here, as you guys can see. So let's take a closer look up at him. And he is the first one in the line of the turtles. So as you guys can see right here, here he is. And his packaging, brand new, which I really do like. And as you guys can see right here, I really, really do like the artwork here, as you guys can see. I just really do love the artwork on here, as you guys can see. We have Donatello there, as you guys can see in the corner. And I really, really do like the artwork. And Nickelodeon did an amazing job at remaking this. There's another one of Donatello there, as you guys can see of him holding the staff. And I really, really do like all the vibrant colors on there. And it really does remind me of the old school Playmates toys. And as you guys can see right there, it says Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Heroes in a Half Shell logo there, as you guys can see. So on the side there, as you guys can see, it says Donatello Weapon, Weapon Bow, as you guys can see with the um, outline of like the turtle shell there, which I really do like there, as you guys can see. And... So here is what the Donatello figure looks like here, as you guys can see in the packaging. And we'll get to opening him up here in a second. And there's another drawing there, as you guys can see, of Donatello, which I really do like. And as you guys can see... Over here in the corner, it says Playmates Toys, which I really do like, and it gives me a really old school vibe of Playmates Toys. I just really, really, really do like the retro packaging and the artwork on here, and it looks super amazing. So there is the front side there, as you guys can see. So let's turn him over 
to this side here as you guys can see. So that's what that side looks like for you guys. And if you guys want to read any of these, please feel free to pause and do so. And as you guys can see right there, it says one good turtle deserves another. And get the good, the bad, and the accessories, which I really do like. And there is like the um, description of Donatello. There, as you guys can see. So there's the back side for you guys. So I'm turning it over to this side here, as you guys can see. So let me come back and I will unbox them and we can take a closer look up at them. And I also forgot to show you guys, but that's what it looks like from up there, as you guys can see. And if I were to lay this down, that's what it would look like there, as you guys can see. And as you guys can see right here, it says amazing turtleistic arm movement, deluxe weapons, assortment, weapons belt, and weapons rack included there, as you guys can see, which I really do like. So as you guys can see right here, I have taken them out of the packaging here as you guys can um, see. So as you guys can see right here, here is the Donatello figure here as you guys can see. I really, really do like the expression on his face and the purple bluish like bandana for like his eyes which I really do like and I really do like the sculpting on the head there which I really do like with the teeth and the mouth which I really do like and and I really do like that he has like a belt with you know the letter D on it which stands for you know Donatello there as you guys can see on his uh, shell I also really do like the bandanas that um, are like on his knees and um, shoulders and like wrist, which I really do like. So there's that side for you guys. So here is the back side. And as you guys can see, that's where you can um, put the accessories that it came with, which I'll show you guys that here in a second. But um, there's that. And I really, really do like his um, shell. So there's that for you guys. So if you guys are wondering what he can do, he can move his head. And they're, um, I want to say like really super hard. He can move his arms up and down. He can do like, you know, the wrist. Same thing on this side. And the feet or the legs do move here as you guys can see. So you can Put his staff here in the back as you guys can see. And I also forgot to show you guys, but it says 
2013 Vietnam Playmates there, as you guys can see. And here is what the bottom of the feet look like here, as you guys can see. So there's that for you guys, and you guys can see that there's a hole right there. So, like, you can put a stand in it or something so that way it'd stand up, which I also really do like. And, um... So yeah, let's take a closer look up at the pieces that Rotella came with. Before we put the pieces, you know, like on them. So here's a staff. You guys can see right here. He also came with this other staff, which I really do like. So if you lost the other one, you have a replacement for it, which I really do like. Um, I forget what these called, but here's... So here's this accessory right here for you guys. There's this accessory for you guys. So there's this accessory for you guys. There's that one. These ones are the stars, so there's that one. So there's that. There's another star there, as you guys can see. So there is Donatello for you guys. And he is super amazing. And I would highly recommend picking him up. And he stands up pretty good, and he can hold his accessories pretty good. And overall, he's just really cool. And I would highly recommend that you guys go and, um buy him at Walmart, so let me move Donatello to the side, and we can take a closer look up at Mikey. So here is Michelangelo here, as you guys can see, which is the second turtle we're going to be taking a look at today, so let's take a closer look up at him. And I'm going to go over all of it, but I'm not going to spend, you know, too much time. But I really, really do like the artwork here. And it shows Michelangelo on the right side with the nunchucks and on the left side, nunchucks and holding pizza, which I really do like. And as you guys can see it right here, it says Michelangelo. Weapon Nunchuck is, which I think, which I really do like. There's another um, drawing of Michelangelo there, as you guys can see, or Mikey. And so there's Michelangelo, or Mikey there, as you guys can see in the packaging. And he looks really, really cool in there, and I'm super excited. I can't wait to open him up. But there he is there, as you guys can see. So there's the front side for you guys. That side... And there's a card back description if you want to pause and read, which I'd highly recommend doing so. And these were released or made in 2021. So there was the back side for you guys. That side for you guys. So there's that for you guys. So let me unbox him and I'll be right back for you guys. So we can take a closer look up at him. So as you guys can see right here, I've taken him out of the packaging here as you guys can see. 
And this is what the card back or card artwork looks like here, as you guys can see. There's the Michelangelo or Mikey figure there, as you guys can see. And there is the accessories there, as you guys can see. So, let me get the accessories off this thing, and um, we'll take a closer look up at them. So, as you guys can see right here, I've taken all the accessories out of this, so let's take a closer look up at them. Alright, as you guys can see, I've taken all Nunchucks. Uh -oh. Then, yes, nunchucks. So there is the accessories for you guys. So there is Michelangelo there, as you guys can see. And I really, really do like the orange bandana on his eyes there, as you guys can see. And I really do like the sculpting on here. Really do like the shell and the um, veins right there, as you guys can see on both sides of his um, arm there. And I really do like the M on the belt, which stands for Michelangelo or Mikey, which I really do like. And I really, really do like the... Uh, the um, orange shoulder um, straps that go around like the shoulder and the wrist and the knees, which I really do like. So there's that side for you guys. So there's that side. Back side. There's that side for you guys. There's the feet there, as you guys can see. And that's like a hole there, so you can, like, you know. Put him on a stand so that way he'll stand, which I really do like. And if we flip him over. It says 2013 Vietnam there, as you guys can see. And it says Playmates, which I really, really do like. So, this is him holding the nunchucks, which I really, really do like. And you can put some accessories on the back of him. Like that. So there is Michelangelo for you guys. So I'll meet you guys right back here. And we'll wrap things up for today. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video on unboxing Nickelodeon's real release of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Donatello, and Mikey from Playmates Toys. So I want to say thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I hope you have enjoyed it and I would highly recommend going to your Walmarts and getting these because they are really well worth it and they're just super amazing. So I want to say thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you have enjoyed it. And I will see you guys next time on Pogo News Around the World. Bye.